Well, good afternoon. Um, please excuse the noise of the fan. It is still really quite hot here in Australia this time of year. So today I was going through my shed looking at things that I may not have shown you and I came across these. Now these fall under the category of, well that's really interesting, but will I ever use it? Now one of these sets is Repco, one of these sets is Barco, and they are go through socket sets. The idea with these being that if you have a long bolt, um, these actually have a hole in them so that the bolt will go right through it and you can use them over a, a lengthy thread and pop in there like that it's just a simple ratchet uh, the Repco one has about 17 pieces the Barco one 14 they were both around the same price about a hundred dollars um, I did get the Repco one special and then I don't think they sell it anymore because I did see it really significantly reduced to like $26 or something one other time but there was none available then and I'd already had one so it didn't really matter yeah like I said I don't believe I've actually ever used these I took the um, cardboard cover off the Barco just to get the box open so there's a few differences as you can see that one there's got a ball deton which holds that in there holds in there quite firmly but not too difficult um, yeah, and this one also has the added option that this will go in there and then you can just use it as a 3.8 drive or if you put this on then that fits all those so as pointless as that seems it's an option I have noticed that it's really quite difficult to get this back out of here you need to sort of push on that then push that through then hold that push it further in to get that off and then pull that out so a bit of a pain in the ass but a little bit more um, useful I suspect this one has a, a standard 3.8 extension for when you have the adapter in and also the deep socket adapter um, yeah so it's a bit, a bit of a handy thing there now the Barco um, has a ratcheting head uh, sorry a flexing head it does have this massive button here that sticks out which I oh, I don't know I'm not real impressed with but it is what it is and it certainly does the job now these ones they have the groove there and the groove on the inside there not sure if you'll be able to see it there but it means you need to work out which way they go in so they go in that way hold in there quite well but pop out quite easily now it doesn't have an adapter to make it like a normal socket but it does still have the uh, extension there and everything goes together quite easily. This one doesn't hold in as tightly as the other. Oh no, yes it does. I just hadn't pushed it far enough. I hadn't pushed it home. So now everything goes together good. Now I'm not sure. I mean I've got several sets of rats and spanners. I've got deep sockets. I'm not convinced that these actually have a place but I guess they're there if I need them I think I bought the Repco one because I was working on some old motorcycles with drum rears and as you've ever adjusted drum rears you'll know that there's a long threaded rod at the back that you screw the brake stopper up against so yeah I'm pretty sure I bought it for that not like I said I can't remember whether I've ever actually used it but that was my intention and the barco just seemed like a nice thing at the time so anyway i wouldn't put a um a cheetah bar on them i don't think they're that strong that one has the 12 point is it more this one here is just a six point interestingly enough they both have the spline drive 
whether or not you think that's a good thing or not. Um, like I said, I haven't really used them. I've not had them any problems with it. But anyway, uh, just uh, another interesting thing I had that you may not have seen and I thought I'd show you. No worries. Thanks for your time.